Greetings. This is Things You Need to Know. I'm Greg Watanabe. The state of Arizona is on a roll. On April 23rd, Governor Jan Brewer of Arizona signed Senate State Bill 1070, or the Shows Your Papers Bill, into law, just in time for May Day and Cinco de Mayo. Well, nice work, Arizona, because is there really a better way to say fuck you to the Latino community than passing a law that discriminates against Latinos on the International Day of Worker Solidarity and Cinco de Mayo? I think not. <laughs> Critics claim that the bill is unconstitutional and legalizes racial profiling. Backers of the bill say they don't racially profile, it's just that they can tell who's an illegal immigrant just by looking at them. Well, kudos, Arizona. Why bother with a slow erosion of civil liberties when you can just go for the whole enchilada? Uh-oh. <laughs> Looks like I may have just given the Arizona police a probable cause. In a follow-up to the Show Us Your Papers bill, Arizona has passed a new law banning ethnic studies in public schools. Apparently, officials there are concerned with what they call, quote, ethnic chauvinism. What's ethnic chauvinism, you ask? Well, it's a lot like male chauvinism, except instead of women saying, baby, don't call me baby, you male chauvinist pig. It's white people saying, whitey, don't call me whitey, you ethnic chauvinist pig. Still confused about what ethnic chauvinism is? Well, it's a lot like the Arizona legislature and state governor saying, you Mexican-Americans, you think you're so superior, don't you? Well, how about if I just cut all your ethnic studies programs? How do you like that, bitches? Who's your daddy now? Who's number one? Gonna get a whoop 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 whoop? <laughs> Arizona, you the man. You the man. Actually, you're the man. There could be some unforeseen consequences of this law, however. Among other things, the law prohibits schools from offering co courses that, quote, promote resentment of a particular race or class of people. From the genocide of Native Americans, to the enslavement of African Americans, to the internment of Japanese Americans, to the arrest of Arab Americans and their subsequent imprisonment in Guantanamo, it becomes clear. Teaching U.S. history promotes resentment of white Americans. But this could work out well for Arizona. Once they eliminate U.S. history from the curriculum, it will be much more difficult for students there to figure out just how racist and unconstitutional the Show Us Your Papers law really is. In sort of a cherry on top move, the Arizona State Department of Education is now banning teachers from teaching English if the teacher's spoken English is, quote, heavily accented or ungrammatical. Responding to claims that teachers will be fired just for speaking with an accent, Arizona officials announced plans to hire teachers from other states to replace them, including Louisiana, Mississippi, Georgia, Kentucky, Tennessee, Virginia, West Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Oklahoma, Texas, and Alabama. We here at Things You Need to Know speculate whether or not Arnold Schwarzenegger and Henry Kissinger will be banned from teaching English to kindergartners in Arizona or whether or not Sarah Palin will be banned from ever speaking in Arizona again. After all, can you understand anything that she says? Or maybe stupid isn't an accent. I'm Greg Watanabe, and this is Things You Need to Know.